Hey, what's up? It's G. I'm back again here on the Hildebrand Lifestyle channel. And today, I really want to talk about your mindset, the creative mindset, right? And I just want to say, like, if you ain't got the right mindset, you can't create anything. It's very difficult to do anything that you that you like or, or love, you know. Um, having the right mindset is, is so important. So today, I just want to go over that a little bit. And it and I, I can prove it too because like a lot of the, the drawings behind me are individuals that I that I that I drew out. They had a different mindset in order to change the world, right? Or change their life, or change the lives of the people around them. They have to have a different mindset. And a lot of times, people just they want to imitate the end result. They want to be on the jets. They want to be on the yachts. They want to have the fancy cars. They want to have the end result. But they don't understand what it took. A mindset. It takes a different mindset to actually change the world, right? Or change your environment. Or change the way you perceive things, right? And it's got to be like some, a lot of times you, you just, you, you got to kind of like zone out. You know, I, I, just, I just, like, I mean, really zone out. Like you, you kind of get into a monk mindset where you just, um, you know, shut everything off, right? And you just you just really tune into your mind and go into a whole different world, right? And that, and that world um, creates a world of your own, a world that's unseen, a world that's not tapped into yet. And that's the most important place to be. You know, it's cool to go to parties, hang out every now and then if that's your thing if that's what you want to do but more importantly you need to tap into your own mind you need to tap into your, your you know your, your 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 self of being your your creative side right and a lot of times that comes in silence like being creative a lot of times is it's a really lonely world. It's a really lonely place, right? Because you, I mean, you, you have to like, you have to go into a zone a lot of times. You know, like people be like, a lot of times they want to get in touch with you and you know call you with some nonsense about you know who's talking about who, the gossip. You know, you can waste your whole life just talking about other people and what they're doing and what they're not doing, what they need to be doing. I mean, that's just, to me, it's just a really a waste of time. Like, you know, um, I've changed my number so many times. It's, you got to just zone out. You got you to get rid of that. That's noise. A lot of that noise and distractions will keep you from fulfilling your dreams and focused on the objective. Right? What is the objective? What's the point? If I'm gonna sit around and talk negative about other people, about what they're doing and what they're not doing, that's just a waste of time, guys. Like, like do whatever you can, do whatever you have to do to block that out. Right? You want to focus in on positive energy, and you want to get into the Hildebrand lifestyle state of mind. Right? And the Hildebrand lifestyle state of mind is about exploring, it's about learning, and it's about growing. Right? We talk about ideas here. We talk about travel here. We talk about exploring new horizons in different places and being creative. That's what this that's what this channel was about. That's what I encourage. And that's what I try to share with others. That's the reason why I've created over 10 different books on how to draw. It really allows you to tap into your mindset. You know, if you think you can draw, pick up one of my books. I break it down into the simplest form. I show you just with using rectangles, squares, and triangles, and circles on how you can actually create anything that you want to draw. You can create it. Um, and I also do it um, here on this channel with some of the videos. I also have another channel on how to draw G. You can, I'll leave a link below, and you can go to that channel and check out some of the videos and learn as well. I understand like everybody's not in a financial position to, to purchase um, a lot of things, but we also sell the Hildebrand Lifestyle t-shirt and hat here on the channel. So if you want to pick up, you know, some gear to support the channel, please be my guest. Uh, much obliged. We appreciate that. But I want to get back into this this, this, this mindset, right? I want to stay focused on the, 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 the mental um, practice, right? Like when you see like some of the greatest athletes, score like Kobe 60 60 points plus Michael Jordan LeBron right right during that time that they're doing that that's from practice 
That's what they were practicing. So it becomes normal. You you practice until it's perfect. You practice until it's normal. You you, you know you constantly get into that mindset so that when you actually perform and you're actually doing something that's so amazing and so great, it's because you spent that time alone tapping into your mindset, getting it, get getting really in tune to yourself, right? Your star player. That's you. You're the star player, the person that you're looking at in the mirror. The mirror doesn't smile until you do. Keep that in mind. The mirror doesn't smile until you do. So everything that you want in life, you have to tap into your mind, right? You have to manifest that. And that's what I try to encourage on this channel more than anything, you know? Um, so when you see like these drawings and um, my ability to create all of these drawings of these amazing people that have contributed to our world, our culture, um, it's because like I can tap, take time out to tap into my my creative side to draw these like in the process of creating these drawings it wasn't perfect a lot of these drawings wasn't perfect to start off with right you go through a process of things being messy and then you got to clean it up you gotta you know sometimes use an eraser but i don't really like to use an eraser i'll just like to continue to draw through my mistakes or draw to what or just draw through the process right it's kind of like painting a lot of times you know when you're painting for those that don't paint, you probably wouldn't know this, but the painting doesn't come out perfect right away. You have to do a sketch, you know, there's layers, there's actually layers. It's really like life if you really think about it, right? There's layers in life. At some point you learn to crawl, then you learn to walk, and then you learn to run, right? Art is the same way. There's a process to everything before you actually manifest, before it becomes a real thing um, where you can actually touch it and feel it, right? You have to manifest this. You have to think, tap into your mind, right? Use your creative side. Think of all the creative things that you can do or you would like to do. And then you sit down, silence, right? Or, you know, you can listen to some music, but those are vibrations. I'm just trying to get you in tune to your mindset, the mindset that, you know, I tap into a lot of times as an artist as a creative, you know, I have to tap into my own mindset and get in tune with this star player. And once I get in tune with the star player, then everything else around me tends to manifest because I'm able to tap into that, that side of my brain and start to create things and things begin to manifest. But if I'm being distracted, right? And constantly answering phone calls, constantly putting out other people's fires, constantly trying to figure out how do I fix this over here? How do I fix that over there? Stuff that I really have no control over, right? But I'm dedicating so much time and energy to it to the point where it pulls me away from what I should be focused on, right? Which is being creative, right? Traveling the world, doing more travel, ex and, you know, expanding my mind, investing in yourself, learning how to be more creative, how to be more productive, right? Um, talking to different mentors um, about how we can take things to the next level. That's what it's about. Don't waste your time and energy being negative, sitting around, doing nothing. Tap into that mind, man. Tap into that mindset. You know, we all have it. And again, if you want to learn how to draw, pick up my books. I have 10, I have 10 books published on Amazon right now that you can pick up. Either one of those books that'll teach you how to draw, how to be creative. Okay, guys. Also, I want you to watch the next video that's coming up. This next video that's coming up will also keep you inspired. Um, you know, we travel around the world. We talk about art talk about growth we talk about exploring and all of that so make sure you watch this next video and if you're new to the channel please like share and subscribe but make sure you watch this next video all right guys see you in the next video peace love and everything <laughs> all right